My name is Tim Scott from Tecumseh, Ontario, and I have been drumming for over 30 years. I started off in school bands, marching bands, rock bands, touring bands, and I spent my share of time in the studio as well. I have also had the privilege of performing as an opening act for bands such as Nazareth, Humble Pie, and Glass Tiger, to name a few. Throughout my career, I have met some great drummers, and they all have the same comment. Love drumming, hate setting up and tearing it all back down. Of course, I was always looking at shortcuts for easier and quicker ways to set up. At the time, my performance setup was more than just a standard kit. I had cowbells and extra toms. I almost had as many cymbals as Terry Bozio. At first, I was buying clamps and add-on boom arms to try and minimize the amount of space I was occupying. One part of my setup consisted of so many cymbals and, and toms. From a distance, it looked like tree branches in the winter. Looking back, I remember using an old throw rug and then a piece of plywood for a stage. Both had duct tape and markings, just so I could remember where each stand was positioned. And of course, to move all that hardware, I used a heavy road case that needed a two-person team just to lift it up and down the stairways. During the 80s, everyone seemed to be switching to this new rack system, which was supposed to help with positioning and, and reduce setup time. But all it really did was add more weight and bulk from the huge tube frame and the extra time for all the adjustments of the extra clamps. Not to mention the new system consumed more space in my road case. If I disassembled it incorrectly after a performance, uh, it took twice as long to reassemble it at the next gig. I was setting up my kit and I vividly remember the legs from a cymbal stand slipped right off the bottom of the base due to a worn wing bolt. Frustrated, I quickly picked up the legs in one hand and the tubes with the other. And I immediately realized that the tubes were half the original weight of the entire stand. This inspired me to begin researching uh, a way to support the tubes without the tripod legs that drummers were so accustomed to using. The pole cap uses lighter polycarbonate plastic with fiber mixed right in the material for extra strength to stand up to the rigors of road life. It's very lightweight and can be used with a variety of tube sizes. 